hello guys here is shivli and you are welcome to my kitchen today i am going to show you how to make eggless mayonnaise in mixer grinder it's very easy and simple recipe and the result is perfect as you can notice it so let's see the recipe at first i have taken a mixer grinder jar and now i am adding 5 to 6 cloves of garlic for a nice flavor and 8 to 10 black peppers you may increase the quantity of black pepper if you like it much and now i am adding half teaspoon of salt regular salt and 1 tablespoon of sugar and now 1 tablespoon of vinegar white vinegar that is called sirka in hindi now i am going to add milk here is half cup of chilled milk i have added it and now i'm taking half cup of refined oil you may take any kind of refined oil there is no problem now i'm adding half cup of oil and later i'm going to add some more now we have to blend the mixture so let's do it we don't have to run the mixer continuously we have to run the mixer like this spontaneously as you can notice it i'm doing it and after about 1 and a half minute I'm going to uncover the mixer jar. Here it is. You can notice guys that it has begun to thicken. So now we have to add some more oil. I'm going to add 1/4 cup of oil now. Here it is, 1/4 cup of oil. And now we have to blend the mixture again for about 2 uh, minutes. Again we have to run the mixer spontaneously like this. Don't run the mixer continuously while making mayonnaise. And after about two and a half minutes, I'm going to uncover the mixer jar. We'll check the mayonnaise. If it is perfect, we don't have to add oil anymore. Mine is perfectly thick, as you can notice. If yours is not perfectly thick, add one fourth cup of oil again and blend the mixture for about one and a half minute. And after that, your mayonnaise will be also perfect. Don't overbeat mayonnaise. If you do so, the mayonnaise can be ruined. so it's now perfect now i'm going to take the mayonnaise into a bowl now you can store this mayonnaise for about 1 month in normal refrigerator and you may freeze it for about 3 months and the recipe is super easy so don't buy mayonnaise from market anymore make it by yourself at home so try this simple recipe and enjoy now you can make sandwiches pastas noodles pizzas anything as you like with this healthy and tasty mayonnaise So try this simple recipe and don't forget to share your experience with me. Hit the like button guys if you really like the video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Hope to meet you in the next video. Bye bye. Take care.